Hey everyone. So this is the second episode of the Grow With Me series for Micro Dwarf Tomatoes. So as you can see here, we have some germination in the Aero Garden Sprout. We do not have any germination yet in the soil. Um, these actually, as you can tell, these have germinated they probably germinated a few days ago. Um, for some reason, I didn't even notice them through the little plastic cup because they were uh, all pushing up against the top. So we are going to have this taste test at the end. So what I'm going to do is take that Rockwell cube out of there. I'm going to actually cut it in half, leave one plant in the sprout, and I'm going to take the other one and plant it in the soil. And the one will grow in the soil, and I'll leave the other one in the sprout. So I'm actually going to do that now, and we're going to see how this goes. So we're getting some good, uh, we're getting some decent roots there. So we want to try to not disturb those as much as possible. I don't see any on the other side, so I'm going to try to split that right down the middle. So let's see, hopefully you can see this okay. So what I'm going to do is take this guy out, being careful of the roots. Now there are actually two roots coming out the bottom. I will assume one is for each plant. So I'm going to try to go right in between the middle with my cutters here and hopefully not cut the roots off. Okay, perfect. So you can see the, the root didn't actually cross through. So this one is for one plant and that one root is for the other plant. So this one I will plant right into the center. Now I do still have the two seeds in here. So hopefully they will still have a chance to sprout. But we are going to put this guy in here. Make a little hole enough to cover the rock. Well, which will in turn cover a little bit of the stem. So what we're going to do now with him, I'm going to leave that in there because I still haven't got a little plate yet. And we're going to set him right up there underneath the arrow garden. So that we can use that light. Hopefully that one will sprout. Now I am going to have to get some more of my little Rockwell cubes. So I can fill in the hole there. Since this one's only going to take up half this spot now. Try to keep that root right down in there. And I just want to I want to fill it in so that it, when the plant grows. It has something sturdy to hold it so it doesn't tip over. So I'm just going to pull a little rock piece of rock will cube off. Soak that in the water if I can reach it. I can barely reach it. Gonna take the top off. Reach in there and soak my cube. Get it nice and wet. Support the one side, just jam that in there. There you go, so now it's full again. And it should be able to support the plant. Now the sprout doesn't have a timer system. So when you turn it on for the first time, the light comes on. And then I believe it runs for 12 hours and shuts off. So you can see it's not on. Because when I did it was at night, most of my other lights... Um, they run for 16 hours, they'll turn off, and then this one turns on. But, that's okay. It's not going to hurt anything. Alright, so we were going to leave it like that, and see how everything goes. 
We will check back probably in about another week. I'm going to try to post these on Monday as we go along and uh, see how things are growing. All right, so stay tuned for next Monday. Till then, if you liked the video, please click the like button. Please subscribe. Leave a comment. Thanks a lot. See you then.